today I am doing a catch up rambly get ready with me. Um, I did try to film a full get ready with me, but my allergies are so bad. Like it's 41 degrees at night, 81 degrees during the day, and we've had the windows open because it's been so nice, but my allergies are insane. So I've been sneezing. I have It's not too thick and it's definitely not too thin. Bethany Franklin sold this stuff out. Sorry, I just had like a 10 minute sneezing bit. Oh, you can tell my eyes are so glassy. This time of the year is really bad for me. And I like to get the Walgreens or deck, which I need to run and go get. And then the Alloway eye drops are amazing. Um, need to go get that. Anyway, I put that on and then these are kind of melted now. These are from. Um, Windhurst Aesthetics, which is where I go and get my Botox and lips done. Love them. I keep these in our eyes. They're still really cold eyes. Like my, my neck and my lymph nodes. And it really helps. Um, and then these, you guys have seen these. They're melted now, but I put these, oh, under my eye. Over my eye. And these really help too. You can get these anywhere. I've seen really good ones at the Dollar Tree. These might even be from the Dollar Tree. Super cute. And they are really great to have on hand. Really and truly. Any kind of ice on your face is so good in the morning. Um, and if you do that, any kind of like cream or moisturizer before you put that cold stuff on, it, it really takes it up level um witch hazel witch hazel this is at cvs walgreens this is so expensive and this is actually this was at dollar general and it was in the dollar section this witch hazel and it's so good the lucky super soft brand it's a little leaky it's been on the side <laughs> listen this has been a weird day a stone fly out of a ring. It's just been a weird day. I don't, I don't know what's going on, but <clears throat> then I was drinking on this, which is San Pellegrino. I'm a sucker for blood orange anything, and this is so not healthy. It's got 29, 29 grams of sugar. Isn't that more than a Coca-Cola? That's why it's so good. Um, but it's made with natural Italian oranges and it just feels a little fancy and I love a good drink. Um, so let me finish that. It's so good. I mean, it's so good. Anything with 29 grams of sugar is going to be good, right? And ow, I'll show you guys this. This is my Clarence little sample bag my aunt gave me. Beauty is full of legit. I had never even heard of it. Okay. This stuff is like medical grade for your face. And I've been using this is extra firming kangaroo flower for around your eyes. It's just the sample. But oh my gosh. If you can get your hands on a sample, I haven't used this yet. 
this is their cleansing water. Um, this is their velvet cleansing milk. Doesn't that sound so yummy? Oh my gosh, I gotta use this. I keep forgetting about it. Um, and then this is the natural lip perfect. Everything's in French. Um, I don't know if it just moisturizes. I saw a little bit of a tint. I don't know that it does. Um, but trust me, it's gonna make it. If it says it's gonna make your lips perfect, it's gonna make them perfect. Um, the other thing I've been using is a tightening balm. from Clarence, like I'm saving all of my money to purchase samples. That's how expensive they are, but it's because I really truly believe it's some of the best stuff ever. Um, okay, so I am going to do, I have not used this yet. This is the e.l.f. Halo Glow in, it's champagne, yeah, it's in champagne. And it is a highlighter. And anyway, so while I'm doing this, I'll catch you up on stuff. If you didn't know, we adopted a sweet five-year-old chihuahua mix. His name was Taz, but he wasn't responding to it. So we named him Sunny. Well, Julian did. It was so sweet. When we got him from the Humane Society, I said, Julian, I said, we need to, you know, rename him, I think, and he's a, he looks like a little tiny golden retriever, and he's got like a little white diamond on his face, and I said, you know, what's like bright, and he started singing, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, and so we named him Sunny. So, there's that, and He's precious. He's housebroken. Um, he doesn't love other dogs, but we're working on it. He's just so sweet. He sleeps with Julian at night. Just loves that. Loves that. Um, he's just a really good boy. He likes to chill. He likes to hardcore chill, but we take him out a lot. We take him on rides. He does great in the car. Like, literally, I'll have to get him. Let me go get him. Tell me. Tell me he's not the cutest thing you've ever seen. What's this? What's this? He's got little human eyes. You can't see, but they're like green. This is his little squeaky owl. Oh, he's so cute. He's got the cutest little tail. Look at his little tail. Where's your little tail? or maybe resin um, but it's beautiful it's blue and I put it on one of my chains this is rescued vintage on one of my chains this is my personal collection um, this is mine and the 
little rescued four leaf clover and French coin, and then this is soda top from my line, and then the matte gold balls. And yeah, I am so <clears throat> I am wanting to go to the next level when it comes to like making jewelry. So I am getting ready to purchase a solder pen. And what you do when you solder, it's like a teeny tiny welding tool. And you basically feed in gold or silver, like these little chips, and you, it's like a next level bonding agent, right? So I'm going to be able to make rings and I have all these cool pieces that really like, I need that solder to make it, to make jewelry that I want to make. I'm also going to be getting a teeny tiny little drill, <laughs> like teeny tiny little drills so that I can put holes and pendants. And I know this is going to be a learning experience, but I love learning. I love really, really, really getting my hands dirty, so to speak. So all very exciting things. I am going to definitely be doing some lashes today, so I am doing a little squiggle, maybe a little tiny more, of glue, and I let this get kind of tacky. These are the Ardell Seamless Under Lash Extensions, the Faux Mink, and I like these, but y'all, I'm telling you. The Kiss 350 at Dollar General. These are so good. And they're medium and they're a little hand tied. They're hand tied, but they're on a little clear strand. So I've been mixing these. I need to go get some more of these. And I, these do stay on really well with this glue. This is not the glue that it comes with, but anyway. I love this new tool. I really needed some like these. These are good. If you don't have these, you can use just regular tweezers with the handles are great, but this, these are, these are good. These are good. Um, okay. <clears throat> While I'm waiting for the glue to dry, this is a new Revlon lipstick for me. I have not tried it. It was the last one. So I feel like it's super popular. It's number 778 and the name is Pink Promise. And I had gone to Ulta yesterday. That's really satisfying. So sad. And I just was so ready. I lost all my pink lipstick where they were old and needed to be thrown out or like they melted over the summer. And so I was like, I really need like I'm doing this for myself. Oh. Oh boy. Wow. What am I not doing right? There we go. I know. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a makeup sniffer. This has no smell. Mm. Actually like a little bit of a smell. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, that's pretty. Now remember, I have that other stuff under me. That is so pretty. Pink Promise. Revlon number 778. Okay, I'm gonna try to pull this off of here. See how it is. And sometimes they come apart, you know. But you want to put the glue. Oh, this is already getting sticky, which is Great. Sorry you can see any of that, but you want to put the glue, of course. And I always wipe that off the glue on top. Because it's gonna be underneath, right? And this is so hard putting this. Oh. Let's try again. Let's try 
<clears throat> extensions. And for whatever reason, see that one fell apart. That sucks when that happens. It's best to grab them like. the base. That's okay though. That's okay. And then when you're putting them on the other eye you have to twist that thing around. was um, in my 20s, I went through a phase where I just, I mean, these have been around forever, the little individual lashes, y'all. I mean, forever. And I would just put lashes on the ends of my eyes, and I had a summer where I did it to all my girlfriends, and we just loved it. We just felt so girly. going on so Julian started soccer it's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life he's getting ready to be five can't believe it cannot believe it um his birthday party is going to be so much fun this year that, um a place called putt putt it's like a arcade and mini golf place miniature golf and they have like these little packages where they get pizzas and they get the little cards um which it's no longer quarters and like the tickets come out which man that that was cool back in the day it's all digital and electronic where it's like all on this card and then you get to go to the front when you're done playing and buy, get like little silly fun toys, you know, and all the kids get one of those. So I'm excited for that and I'm telling you the key to everybody that looks like looks like being the keyword has their stuff together. You know what it is? They just start preparing so early and start doing stuff so early that it's do I get I got close. Don't do get ready's with me. Um, with stuff like this, <laughs> with lashes, with the hard stuff. But yeah, anyway, so I've just been preparing super early. His birthday's less than a month, and I just know it'll be here like that. So I'm actually going today to order his cake from a bakery, and he's really into Captain America, but he's also obsessed with spider-man and like he watches all the spider-man shows but he's gonna be captain america for halloween so do i do 
a Spider-Man cake? Do I do a Captain America cake? Or do I do one that has them both on there? I don't know, but I have to decide by today. Um, and then, you know, the holidays are going to be here. The holidays are going to be here before you know it. I'm not going to do anything to my hair today, I don't think. Um, I'm really trying not to add heat to my hair. So probably just keep it in the chignon. This is fine. Aren't these great? These new sunglasses. Love these from Amazon. Three pack. Um, we are doing house projects. It's a lot of bathroom stuff and bathroom stuff sucks. I so wish I knew how to like do stuff and be independent, but I just want it professionally done and that takes so forever because then you're on someone else's schedule. I'm a Leo and very, very impatient. However, I do require that you have a lot of patience with me. That's how we are. <laughs> that is how we are. Um, I'm getting my hair done, trying to decide if I'm going to go a little bit darker to get my hair a little bit healthier. I've got silver gray hair. Um, Rolling, 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 rolling. And I hope this was fun to watch. It's a bit chaotic. Um, and I promise I will come with like a full get ready with me. And hopefully it won't be like massive sneezing attacks and dogs barking and all the things. But oh, did I tell you guys that I rehomed the birds? It's not because of y'all, so don't feel guilty. Um, they're just so messy and they were really loud like in the morning at seven o'clock it was like living with roosters um so they went to a lady's house who has um these are for sale by the way these little bows they're vintage i think they're avon um she has an aviary and all these birds and she's been staying in touch um so that's been really great and julian does not miss them like it was okay like there's actually a little bit more relief than sadness, and that lets me know I made the right decision. Um, I'm getting a new tattoo right here. You'll see that soon. And then I'm going to get a bigger piece right here. I don't know when that will happen. Probably not till October sometime, but I will do a, uh, like, to reveal all the things, tour, whatever. I don't know if you guys are interested in that, but I love you so much, and I will see you next time.